We have removed the cover slip. Now we will perform de-staining and de-crosslinking. In this video series, we will use the 11 millimeter gasket. In the demonstrated protocol and user guides, volumes for 11 millimeter gaskets are annotated with a triangle. Prepare 0.1 normal HCL using nuclease-free water. Thaw decrosslinking buffer at room temperature. Prepare diluted decrosslinking buffer by adding nuclease-free water and decrosslinking buffer. Vortex and centrifuge briefly. Obtain the Visium slide seals. Fold in half lengthwise and cut along the fold. These pre-cut slide seals will be used for the tissue slide cassettes only. Place a low profile thermocycler adapter in the thermocycler. Prepare the thermocycler with the following incubation protocol and start the program. The tissue slides were previously dried on the thermocycler. Place the slide in the Visium Side Assist tissue slide cassette. Refer to the Visium Side Assist tissue slide cassette assembly video for detailed assembly instructions. Next, we will de-stain the tissue. Add 300 microliters of 0.1 normal HCL along the side of the wells to uniformly cover the tissue sections without introducing bubbles. Tap the cassette gently to ensure uniform coverage. Using a pipette, remove the HCL from the wells. Ensure that all solution is removed from the wells. Add 200 microliters of 0.1 normal HCL along the side of the wells to uniformly cover the tissue sections without introducing bubbles. Tap the cassette gently to ensure uniform coverage. Apply a pre-cut slide seal on each cassette and place the cassettes on the low-profile thermocycler adapter at 42 degrees Celsius. Close the thermocycler lid. Skip the pre-equilibrate step to initiate destaining. After the destaining incubation is complete, remove the cassette from the low-profile thermocycler adapter and place on a flat, clean work surface. Some color remaining in the tissue after destaining is normal. Next, we will decrosslink the tissue. Prepare the thermocycler with the following incubation protocol and start the program. Carefully pull the Visium slide seal up and over from the edge while firmly holding the cassette. Ensure that no liquid splashes out of the wells. Using a pipette, remove all of the HCL from the well corners. Add 300 microliters of diluted decrosslinking buffer along the side of the wells. Remove all of the diluted decrosslinking buffer from the wells. Add 200 microliters of diluted decrosslinking buffer along the side of the wells. Reapply the pre cut slide seal on the cassette. Place the cassette on the low-profile thermocycler adapter at 95 degrees Celsius. Close the thermocycler lid. Skip the pre-equilibrate step and initiate decrosslinking. Once decrosslinking is complete, remove the cassette from the low-profile thermocycler adapter and place on a flat, clean work surface. Proceed immediately to the Visium Side Assist Spatial Gene Expression for FFPE user guide. We have de-stained and de-crosslinked the tissue. Next, we can proceed to the Visium Cytosis Spatial Gene Expression for FFPE user guide. 